Am I thinking? Because I know, I know Power Positivity also goes by JJ. And I see the two J's in your name. So I'm get. That's JJ? Okay, I figured. Okay, but hey, yo, what's up, JJ? Haven't seen you in a while, dude. Welcome on in. The pipe rejected you. Damn. What gives you, Ozzy Pipe? We gotta tell the professor about this. Well, wow, imagine getting rejected by a pipe. What what are, what are the odds of that? Of getting rejected by by a pipe? Can you imagine that? You just go you just go out to a random war pipe, you go inside in it, and it just rejects you. Imagine, what are the odds of that? It's okay, I got rejected by pipes all the time. Damn. That sounds like a that's that's a big oof. That's a big oof. <laughs> Mario shouldn't have brushed up on his flirting so the pipe wouldn't have rejected him. He's like No, I, I mean I'm sure he's probably thinking like Oh, baby. Please allow me to clean your pipe someday. Okay, no, no. It's, it's, I don't want it to get too hot in here. <laughs> Yo, Professor, we found your pipe and the thing's all stopped up. We tried and tried, but we can't break through it. Got any dry cleaner? Drain cleaner? What? You can't throw through the pipe, you say? How odd. Hmm, I'm afraid I haven't the foggiest idea what you should do. Oh, of course. I've heard that a fellow from Twilight Town lives here in Rogueport. If anybody knows how to get through that pipe, it'll be him. His name was, uh, Ding. What was it? Oh, uh, yes. Oh, Rydia. Oh, uh, let's go. Oh, Rydia, let's go. Yo, Rydia, thank you so much for giving that gift sub to Owie. Yo, Owie, welcome on in to the High Roll Sub Club. I hope you enjoy your sub badge and your tier 1 emotes for a good month. Welcome to the High Roll Sub Club. But, Owie, I think you know what this means. You now finally have access to my Peach Clap emote. So, so as, these, as far as these Peach emotes go, they're yours now. You finally get them, thanks to Rydia. You can use them now. Enjoy. Enjoy your newly peach emotes. Some pipes have high standards. I mean, true. True. <laughs> ah, yes, the level of dark places. Darkly. I've seen him loitering around here in these parts of town in the past. Look for Darkly. Okie dokie. Need to go look for Darkly. You know, I want to try the communication with other partners here okay there's no heart piece here also there's darkly hi there the name's darkly i'm from twilight town do you guys need something huh you can't get to the pipe into twilight town that's a really thick voice buddy well shocks there's usually no sweats you just need to have something that has your name written on it don't you have anything that has your name run on it? Come on, everybody does. You know, it's kind of weird, like, like, doesn't Mario's cap not actually count as having his name on it? I mean, obviously we all know what the M stands for. No, really? Okay, hang on, I'll write it for you. What's your name? Mario. Mario, huh? I'll write it here on, on the seat of your overalls. M-A-R-I-O, right? The run in my butt? What the hell's wrong with you? That's Perfecta Mundo. While I'm at it, I'll write your partner's name too. What's your name? Goombella. <laughs> that tickles. Uh huh? I'm, s I'm sorry, what did you say? Bruh. I don't know, it's how easy to stand for Manaphori or Ms. Miles, though. Probably. Yeah, he kind of does sound like Sans from Undertale. <laughs> also, Ali, enjoy your work. 
I don't know when Aaron is taking you to Twilight Town, but I hope it goes well. I'll be rooting for you. What is that guy doing in Goomba? I know, what are they doing to my... What are they doing to my Goomba partner, bro? Okay, you know what? Before we go, I actually want to practice Super Guarding. I really want to practice my Super Guarding. Okay, because I got to tell you guys something. So, let me tell you guys something. So, my friend Momo. Um, Momo Pokemon. So... She was playing this game yesterday, and she was and she has never played this game before. And let me tell you something, guys. She just finished. She okay. So she just finished chapter two in her playthrough, right? And all the party, all the only party member she had up to was just to flurry. She hasn't started chapter three yet. So let me tell y'all something, y'all. She actually went. All the way to the pit of a hundred trials, got through every floor, and killed a bone tail. At the start, early start of the game, I was literally shocked. But if y'all want to see my friend do that, that's her channel right there. Momo fucking kicked ass. She only got all the way to the end of chapter two, came to the pit of a hundred trials. Got through every single floor and defeated Bone Tail, the hardest boss in the entire game with only up to 200 HP. I was like, oh my god. That was crazy. Yeah, the Battle Master is you. Are you going to teach me how to fight, Hilly? That's insane. I know, she got through all of that that quickly. Fit. Yeah, I ruined your practice. No, nah, I don't want that. I don't want Super Guardian. Okay, how can I get good at the tutorial? Too fast. Okay, is there like the perfect way to master these? Because I don't know how to do these correctly. Or... One, two, three. Too fast. I'm so too fast. One, two, three, four. Too fast. I really want to get good at this, but I, don't, I do not know how. What the hell? Bruh, I'm literally pressing the button. Dude! I have no idea what I'm doing wrong. Sonic says, you're too fast, gotta go fast. Bruh. Yeah, I do not know how to get good at these. But, oh my god. I mean, I probably will figure it out at some point, but I need to get really good at Super Guarding. Okay, practicing? Yes, yes, Master Hilly. <laughs> go go yes, Master. <laughs> Okay, are you still in the warrior bench? Oh my god! Guys, he's selling the warrior badge. He's got the warrior badge. You guys know we gotta get this. You know we're gonna buy this. We have to buy the warrior badge. Let me put into words you may understand. Oh, we are gonna wear this for this chapter. We're going to put this on. Yeah! Oh yeah! Here we go! Ho ho! Oh yeah! Ha <laughs> ha! Wario! Oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah. We get the Wario badge. Please tell me there's a Waluigi one. Well, kind of. There kind of is, but you can actually put on Waluigi's clothes. You can. 
There is a way. There's no badge for Waluigi, but you can, but you actually can put on his clothes. There is a way. Imagine Kokiri Force and Young Link were facing Sephiroth. We're doomed. All right, in the words of Wario, here we go. Oh yeah. Actually, wait. Is it a? Uh... Excellent. That is totally excellent. Chapter four for Pigs the Bell Tolls. Imagine Sephiroth was sentenced away from Link. That's when you super guard. I hope that analogy was more helpful. All right, I want to hear what Twilight Town sounds like. Ooh, okay. Where's my sea salt ice cream? No music start. Ah, this place gives me the creeps. Is this Twilight Town? Hey. It's been a long time since anyone's come from outside. You've come from far away? Yeah, those clothes of yours. I'm sure you guys might be adventurers, right? This is a bad time to arrive. Wait. But you're adventurers. Maybe it's the perfect time. Wait, what? A bad time? What do you mean by that? Come on, tell me. Oh, gee whiz. I don't know. It's a scary tale to hear. And, and scary to tell, too. Oh, shit. The bell rang. Oh, this is awful. Who could it be now? Piggy! Whoa! Also, I like the new Yoshi animation. That was the craziest thing I've ever seen. What's going on in this weirdo town? <laughs> All about this. Now poor Gloomer got started to a pig. Not good. I've always loved the gothic atmosphere in this chapter. I freaking love it. I really love it. Everyone in this town sounds like Sans. You sound like Sans. You sound like Sans. We all sound like Sans. <laughs> Who are you, Gramps? I'm the mayor of this poor town. So I'll call me Dower. I'm not exactly the sharpest fellow, but I do believe you're adventurers, right? This isn't the place for the telling the tale, Sally. Come. Come to my home. Wait, he doesn't have a back sprite? Dower doesn't have a back sprite? I wonder why. <laughs> My traveling friends, welcome to Twilight Town. Well, I'd like to welcome you. But welcoming people is generally a good thing, and it's nothing but a bad here. Oh? As you may have guessed, our town has been cursed. Whoa, cursed? Yes, cursed. That is the right word, right? Yes, of course it is. You see... Beyond town is a forest, and in its heart is an ancient building. The creepy sequel. The dark creature lives there. Its curse ordains that uh, that when the steeple bell rings, one of the twilighters living here in the village becomes a pig. I thought they become nobodies. They don't become nobodies? Will my loved ones become, become swine? Will I too become a curly-tailed oinker? I'm so worried, I can't sleep at night. Of course, night and day are pretty similar here. If this keeps up, well, the village will be one giant pig pen, which would be bad. Let me give you some advice. Leave us. Leave before you too get pigified. Not gonna happen, Gramps. We're looking for something really important. Maybe you've heard of it. It's a star-shaped rock called the Crystal Star. Nah, uh, I don't know about any crystal star thing, but a creepy steeple... Is a glittery red stone shaped like a star. What, are you serious? That's gotta be the crystal star. Gotta be. Uh, you people aren't thinking of going to Creepy Steeple, are you? Oh my god, it's a new animation! <laughs> oh, dude, I, dude, this game is so great. <sighs> Unthinkable. Also, Twilight Town sounds really cool. I'm loving the new theme. Kinda of definitely get some KH Twilight Town vibes a little bit. A little bit. Does that mean Mario's gonna have a bad time? 
Yeah, he's gonna meet with a terrible fate, and then a giant moon's gonna crash down, and then he's gonna have three days to save us all. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen. A nasty monster lives in the woods past here. I'm serious. That's what somebody said. If you still want to go through even after hearing that, you need the mayor's permission. Oh, man. The old monster beyond the town thing gets... Excuse me. Beyond the town gate thing? Isn't that kind of cliched? you got to be kidding. Fine. Let's go ask. Oh, someone's crying in the other room. Whoa, the bell rang, Gonzalez. Doesn't that mean someone's gonna... Boy, I'm psyched. It wasn't my turn to get pigged. Oh yeah, this one. This one's gonna be depressing. I haven't been able to buy food for my children since my husband turned into a pig. Now they're all so hungry. What should I do? Mommy, I'm hungry. Food, please. Kind traveler, if you have some spare food, could you share it with us? Of course. Here you go. Have a mushroom. Oh, thank you so much. You made my children very happy. And me as well. I'm not- it's not much, but please take this as a thanks. Oh, that's gonna be convenient. Oh, and kind traveler, where do you hail? This is where it's gonna get really sad. Oh, now the kids are crying! <laughs> no! Oh, this is- Bruh. This is really sad. Hey, fix my mommy! Bruh. Mommy, you're a piggy. Hey, are pigs good eat- WHAT?! Bruh. Bro. Damn. Holy shit. <laughs> Rated E for everyone! Oh! Whoa, this ain't good. Don't you think the pig is the mayor? What are we gonna do now? We needed that dude's okay to get to pass through the gate. Piggy? Pig? Oh, wait, oh! Oh, we can actually hit the pigs. That kid's going to be grounded after mommy returns to normal! Yeah, yeah, that kid's gonna get all punished and like the mom's gonna be like, go to your room. Just go to your room, child. What? The mayor's a pig? Oh no, what do we do? Govern ourselves? Well, there's just no way I can't let you now get through now. It's martial law time. Just forget about it. Okay, he needs to get turned into a pig. Yeah, I know I know that the guard the guard the guard the gate guy has to be turned into a pig. Piggy? Pig? Bacon? Crispy bacon? Anyone want anybody craving for some bacon? I mean, I think we're, are we all aching for some bacon? Aching for some bacon. Come and get your free bacon. Bacon for everyone. Bacon for me, bacon for you, bacon for everyone. Oh, this is where the lady's crying. Yo, what's up, Spider? How you doing, buddy? Good to see you again. Oh, a customer. I'm sorry. Wait, we're not open right now. Oh? Huh? Why am I crying? My husband's been turned into a pig. A pig. Oh! My husband went to the, wood to the woods yesterday to collect herbs. But no husband come home and said a pig returned. This pig. We got into a fight before he left and he called himself a, a chauvinist pig. And now he really is a pig. But he has a sweet sign too, like cover cooking my favorite friend of my birthday, you know. And when choppers get rude, my husband escorts him out in such a manly way, you know, he just got so many wonderful things going on for me, you know. I wish he wouldn't dip into the cola money, you know, you know, I could really do it without him. It's in the own way, you know, no matter how often a court injury, I don't think I could do that, but have I false to you, you know, like maybe you know, you know. Oh how can I say you know? Is he like that one guy from 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 the beginning of Kingdom Hearts 2 who always says, you know? I forgot what his name is, but I know he's a Final Fantasy character. At least from what I've heard. Even though I've never played the Final Fantasy game he's from. No, it's not Waka. I don't think... I don't... It's not Waka. 
No, no, Waka's not in Kingdom Hearts 2. It's not Waka. I'll do whatever I can to help. You can even take whatever you want from the store if you help, you know. You know? You know? Raijin? I think that... Is that his name? Well, the gate guy's gone. Oops. Nope, not gone. The stubborn dude's a pig. Well, hey, that's actually pretty sweet for us. No pig's gonna get in our way. Oh, for, oh, for Final Fantasy VIII? Gotcha. I've actually never played Final Fantasy VIII. Ooh, new... Wait. Huh? What's this rock doing here? Okay, that rock was not in the original game. Why did they put that rock there? That rock was not in the original. I do not remember there being a rock. Uh, it's a great game, although... Yeah, I, I... So, I definitely am aware that, like... That, um... Final Fantasy definitely has, like, a... Like, a love-hate relationship kind of thing. I mean, that I am totally aware of. Like, I know there's some people who like it, and there are some people that just... That just... Plain right hate it. But then again, I can't say anything about it, because I actually have never played it. But I would like to stream it at some point. Not sure when. But... I'd be down for a cool play. Ooh, new battle theme! Let's go! And we get a cool little battle theme. Let's go! Kind of gives me some Halloween vibes. I like it. This definitely s sounds like something you would hear like on Halloween. Okay, you know what? When October comes, I'm going to be playing this song almost all the time. <laughs> I know what I'm playing during 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 Spooktober. Oh, I did it too slow. Bruh. Alright, give me some flower power. Flowers? Paper Mario Halloween Party. Oh, that, that would be really fun. Maybe I can host one this year. That would be really cool. I'm gonna have to figure out what to do and how to plan one. That sounds really fun. A Paper Mario Halloween Party. Oh, no, you don't. Alright, we gotta get rid of him. Come here. Oh, no. We're dead. We're dead. Oh! We gotta have dupless? Exactly, yeah. You can't do it without dupless. You gotta have the dupe. Yeah, you gotta get the man on board. You gotta get dupless there. You gotta get Vivian there. You obviously gotta get Vivian. Oh my god, this is so cool. I freaking love it. Ooh! But oh my god, even the even the, the outside area sounds creepy as fuck. God, everything here sounds so cool. Oh yeah. It sounds really freaking cool. I love it. Man. Oh no 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 no. We gotta tattle. Man, I, I am so in love with this game, y'all. Y'all have no idea. I actually am really loving this game so much. Oh, that's not good. Okay, we gotta get this guy out. Hyper Goombas. Dude, I used to be so annoyed with these Goombas back in the first Paper Mario on 64. I used to hate doing it with their stupid charge attack. It was so stupid. 
I just freaking hate it though. Down. These freaking hyper Goombas and their charge attacks. Oh, let's go, baby. The hyper thingy, yeah, that move is a pain. Oh yeah, it is definitely is a pain. Yeah, it's definitely is a pain in Chapter Three in the original. So that's where you mostly fight those enemies, but but here it can be a little bit painful just by a bit. Oh great, now I'm fighting three of them. Oh, ain't that lovely? Well, that's lovely. Not gonna make me fight three of them. Three? Big number three, my lord. <laughs> also, I really like the color lights, like on the stage. Definitely kind of sets the sets the mood, sets the theme for chapter four. Really sets the mood. Oh my god. Oh, that's not good. Okay, I have an idea. Okay, I'm gonna have to go for a six. I'm gonna have to get a higher number. Give me that high number, baby. Yeah, yeah. High number, please. Ooh. Oh, what? Three. Well, we gotta have one for each piece of the Triforce, all day, every day. Even when I, even when we're not playing Zelda, you always gotta have one. You always gotta have a piece of the Triforce somewhere on you. Okay, at least I got one problem to deal with. Oh. Yeah, there was no way I was gonna super guard that. Absolutely not. I'm like, I am not gonna super guard that. No way. There was no way I'm planning on that. No super guard, no thank you. Oh, yeah. Gotta get some monies. No, actually, no, no, I, I actually do need coops. Coops, my boy! Got a shop key. Nice. But man, y'all, I can definitely say without a doubt that this game is actually really, really addicting. It's so damn addicting. But I love it. That's why it's like definitely it's like one of the greatest games ever made. It's just it's just beautiful. It's perfect. Okay, let's see what items we got in here. Let's go to the storage room. Oh yes. Okay, so same items from the original. One jam and jelly. One boot sheet, even though I'm probably not gonna be able to use that. One light one light shroom. Defend plus badge. Okay, I would like to quit that. The last good paper Mario. Wait, this one? Wait, this game? I mean, this is definitely is a really great game, but I also did like I also did like Super Paper Mario. I thought that was I thought I thought that one was also was a good game. I actually really did. I actually really enjoyed Super Paper Mario. No, I will say though, Color Splash. I mean, Color Splash. It's okay. It's not perfect, but it's okay. Sticker Star, trash. Origami King. It's good. Not a big fan of the battle mechanic, but I like it. I thought it was okay. Hold up. Hey, who's there? I just heard a voice. There's no way that people could be here. Seriously, that's just so unlikely. 
Oh? Huh? What's that you say? You've seen a chest like this before? Get out of here! No, 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 not, I'm not like those chests, I promise, look in my eyes! Tell me I'm lying! I'm not, seriously, just get me out of here, you'll see! Don't make me beg! What? Come on, you know how ridiculous you sound right now? I'm laughing in here! You honestly think I'm going to curse you when I get out? Curse you? Yeah, for fuck's sake, why would you curse someone? <laughs> Well, I did plan on doing something to you, but it's not so much a curse as a... Well, a really wonderful new ability that will allow you to go to special places. Doesn't that sound nice? Hmm. Aw, oh, come on, please. Just find this key and open the, ch the chest, okay? I know it's near this town somewhere. I just can't go for it for myself, because I'm in here. So, pretty, pretty, please? Oh, yeah. What is... Wait, is that... Oh, my. Oh, my. You already found the key? Oh, happy day. Sure, here's my keyblade. Fools! What were you expecting? Did you think a lovely lady will pop out or something? Now I'm going to hit you with the king of curses, the cursiest curse ever. For my fear of my terrible power, you will know the pain of having your body roll up real small. Be cursed! <laughs> now you're cursed, loser. Savor your suffering. When this curse strikes you, you won't be able to walk. You'll be forced to roll around as a tacky tube. Wee <laughs> your suffering amuses me. And and so I laugh. Now show me your cursed plight so I can laugh all the more. Just press and hold ZR then rotate repeatedly. Oh my god, the tube! You practically misery thrills me to the car. When you're in that form, you most likely roll everywhere like some embarrassing extruded wheel. I want to get a good look, long look at you at this pitiful form. Now roll. Roll like a dropped butterscotch on a sidewalk. What? <laughs> well, do you see how pitiful and tubular you are? When the suffering becomes too much, press B to revert to your normal self. Don't forget. Tell me, do you understand your eternal cylindrical agony? I understand. I leave you to suffer, fools. Never play them, though. I'll, so I'll try anything at once. Yeah, I would definitely would recommend Super Paper Mario and the Wii. It's actually a really good game. You open the sword room, I see. Feel free to take whatever you want out of there. That's a good trade for a chance to get my husband back, I think. No sense in fretting, though. I should get the sword ready for business. She wish my husband back in normal foot to run to place, you know. A haunter was in that treasure chest. Yeah, I mean it. It was in there. I should have. I should have caught it. I should have caught it. Welcome back, Spider. Also, welcome back, so Sora. I love it. It's so cool. It's it's really eerie, and it kind of definitely fills this place up with, with dread. Like the theme definitely kind of fills it up with dread in a sort of way. I really do like that, but also, one thing, Sora, it definitely gives me a little mini Kingdom Hearts kind of vibe to it. I don't know if that also applies to you as well, but it definitely kind of gives me a little bit of Kingdom Hearts vibes with the music. I will keep side to finish the game 100%, though. I want to keep playing, but there's nothing else left to do. Well, play it again! <laughs> Replay! Make a new file. No, yeah, it, yeah, it sounds really Kingdom Hearts. Also, Sora, can you explain to me why this rock is here? Because this rock was not in the original game. I don't know who I, whose idea at Nintendo it was to, to put that there. So I must continue my backlog. Oh, no worries. What are you going to play now, Sora? I have the one on Wii. Going to give it a try intervention. Oh, yes. Definitely play the Wii version. Okay, we're gonna power bounce you. Come here, you. And you run away. 
I know they rocked through me off when I first got. I, I know, I was like, why is that fair? <laughs> I'm just like, why is that even here? Who put the rock there? Yeah, Reddy has never played Super Paper Mario, Sora. She's never played it. Reddy actually wants to give it a go. But I also warn about Sicker Star. Definitely gotta be on the be on the lookout for stars with stickers. Oh, of course we would do that. Why is it so good? We don't seek speak of Sicker Star. That game doesn't exist. But also, Sora, I can say I really like the battle theme, too. The battle theme is definitely is on point. I really do admire it. Okay, let's go in and get uh, Vector out. We gotta get the detective out. Everyone's favorite detective. I never beat any Paper Mario before, and this is the only one I played. Gotta get to got the hotel sale. It's got second game up though. Well, if I can give another recommendations recommendation radio, I would also would play the first game, Paper Mario 64. Now that game is absolutely a classic. It's really good. If anything, I would I would definitely would without a doubt recommend the first Paper Mario. Paper Mario 64 is actually is really really fucking good. I would so play it. I would play it and give it a, and give it a, give it a go. Just give sticker star. <laughs> And then we can spick and then and then of course Sora, you can definitely skip the crayon fan game. <laughs> uh have it on Wii U Virtual Console. There you go. Yeah, it's also on Switch Online, the the first Paper Mario. It's also on there too. So if you wanted to, you can also play it on there. Also, Sora, this is also new. The save block right here. This was not here in the original game. That's also new. Also, I remember that being there. Wii U is better for that game anyway. Oh, I agree. Yeah, the Wii U is better for Paper Mario 64. Plus, you get a full screen. You get to play on full screen. I'm kind of glad they put the save bar there. I am too. I'm glad they put that there. I'm gonna get so lucky. Lucky, we actually find an amazing Daisy, which I'm hoping. I'm hoping we we get to find one. I don't have the N64 Switch Online controller for Switch. Well, 64 games. I mean, you can definitely still play N64 games. Like you know. So, Rydia, you don't actually need the actual, like, N64, um, model-ish controller to play N64 games. You can just use, like, a pro controller, kind of like what I'm using to play this game. Or you can just use, like, your Joy-Con and grip. Like, you don't, like, the N64 controller is not required. It's completely optional. It works for any controller. Any controller will work. That goes for all the NSLs. Any controller will do. Pro controller... Joy-Cons, Joy-Con with grip, any controller will work. Yeah, you didn't yeah, the N64 is not controller is not required. It's just there for show. Yeah. 
uh, on Switch, the Chapter 5 boss frame drops. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the Chapter 5 and um, 64 actually does drop frames for Paper Mario 64. I, I use my Switch Pro Controller and NSO. Same. I, too, also use it. Uh, I know I'm trying to use the C buttons with the second to send a little silly though. Yeah, it is a little bit strange though, but it's still, but it's still, it's still useful to me. It's still useful, and it definitely is a fun way to play games. But I still recommend it. I wouldn't, I wouldn't let that ruin your, ruin the experience for you. I would still play it. I would shout the frames were dropping during that fight. Yeah, and the only reason why that frames usually drop in that fight, Sora, is because of the, um... It's because of the, the Tidal Wave attack by Sushi. So that's also capable of making things worse. Is, uh, the Tidal Wave move. Ooh, Earthquake! the hell oh my god amazing ah damn it no amazing even when he attacked the frames were dropping yeah yeah the tidal wave attack also does frame drops it's crazy i do plan on playing it though yes definitely play paper mario 64 play it Bro, why are you running away? Don't you want hugs? I got donuts and cookies. <laughs> I mean, we all like donuts and cookies. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's keep going back out so we can tattle. Nope, not today. Oh, uh, of course we got hyper clubs here. Of course, this 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 clowns here. I'm I'm hoping maybe today we'll find some. We'll find an uh, amazing Daisy. Yeah, what Sora's saying, you can actually do all that. Yeah, I agree with Sora. It really will help you out. Yo, see, 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 Sora knows exactly what's up. Sora's the MVP. This is why it's always great to have Sora here. Sora, Sora's just the MVP. Whoa! Oh, yeah. And of course, it's a fall. Whoa! Oh my god. Wow. I don't know. What I'm Sorry, you are the MVP. You 100% of the game. You are the MVP. Sora is MVP. You are best mine. You're freaking hilarious. Sora, we love you. Sora MVP. I'm a with this game, what can I say? I mean, I am too. I love this game so much. I love it so much. This is such a damn good game. Okay, let's hear the new song. No new song. Okay, so that's also new. So in the original game, it was just a little tiny circle. But now it's not anymore. So that's also... Dude, they're dropping a lot of new stuff in this game. Like, oh my god. Like, Nintendo had to go all out into making this game perfect for everybody. Like, oh my lord. 
And when I mean they went all out, they went all out with this game. Oh my god! Oh! 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 It's you! Oh! 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 Alright, we're gonna... Alright, time to time it out. Okay, we gotta put it on timeout. Time it out. Come here, you. Come here, you. Oh, what? Oh, what? Bro. Bro. Okay, I gotta tie I gotta tattle it anyway. Before it's too late, I better tattle it. I'm gonna tattle it. I'm tattling on it. Okay, it's a good thing I tattled on it, but it's gonna run away. Like a Pokemon. Yep, there it goes. There it goes running away like a Pokemon. Tattletail. Listen, at least I got its tattle log. So that counts. So that counts that I actually got its tattle log. But man. That sucks, bro. That totally sucks. That sucks. I cannot believe I missed it. Oh. Ooh, shine sprite. Nice. Squidward laugh. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at creepy steeple! Yo! Yeah, this is creepy steeple. That nasty monster's place. This place wigs me out. Look, it's always let's just get that crystal star and get out of here fast. Oh my god, it sounds so creepy. Also, that was not here before in the original game. That that wooden plank there. That wasn't there before in the original. Oh, well that works. Who oh, just blame Bowser? Yes. Yes, Blaine Jack Black. When in doubt, Blaine Jack Black. <laughs> Gotta blame him. Blame him that Chris Pratt's on the Mario movie. Okay, so I do want to come in here. Ooh, we got Ice Smash. Cookbook. That's gonna be for later. Oh, yes. You know, I'm all, I always been curious. How are they able to fit all this stuff in a little tiny hole? Why like they have it in this little small crevice? How are they able to fit all of that in there? My friends have all been taken away. So lonely. Seems a little bit sus. My friends are all gone. I'm so very lonely. Contacts? Wait, what? <laughs> Me fans, there was once a door there, and they removed the door, and they put a wall there. Yeah, I was like, how, how did they, how were they able to put that in there? How would they put, how would they put all that stuff to that tiny hole? Isn't there a secret there? Isn't there like a badge over there? 
Oh, it's this way. Duh. There we go. This can mean so many different things. Yeah, like, like, why does the moon and Majora's Mask have a face on it? Did somebody draw it with crayons? Very, very carefully. Maryland voice. Duh. <laughs> Look at all the booze! Okay, it's quiz time, interloper. Just now when the box opened, how many of those booze came out total? 200. Good. Very good. Take this, math nerd. See you, sucker. Yo, what's up, Koga? How you doing, buddy? Got an Ultra Shroom. Nice. Oh my god, Sora. Nerd! <laughs> I'm gonna like, glad, you, glad to hear it. Are you going to be mean to me? No. Promise. Come on out, guys. You're gonna be mean to the boo, Sora? Why would you do that? Sorry, Goombella. Get out of here. Why couldn't why couldn't Mario do this in Luigi's Mansion 1? He who oh, he you said he'd be nice. Let's get him, guys. All right, let's see Atomic Boo. How are we looking, Atomic Boo? Also, he's got a King Boo voice. I like how he's got a... Oh, this is a cool theme. This is the boss I missed my OG run when I tattled long. Oof. You know, you know what would really make sense in the original in the original Thousand Year Door for this game? If they actually instead of calling this game Atomic Boo, they should have called him Boo Losses, like from the first Luigi's Mansion. Because when you do think about it, that's pretty much what Boo Losses is in the first Luigi's Mansion game. It's just nothing but a bunch of boos just piled up together to make one giant big boo. That's basically what Boo Losses is. I don't see why they couldn't just call him Boo Losses. Where's the boulder goes 3,000 when you need it? Oh, 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 I broke it. I was cleaning the other day and I tripped on it and it broke. That would have been really cool. Having King Boo as a secret boss here. That would have been really nice. Because Atomic Boo definitely has the King Boo voice. Oh, fudge. Okay, we're gonna do sweet treat. Miss opportunity. I know, I know. I should have, I should have brought the poltergeist, but I broke it on accident. Yeah, I was trying to, I was trying to clean, I was trying to clean my house today, and I tripped on it, Rydia, and it broke. And I fucking broke it. They said they were gonna make me pay sixty nine coins to to use to fix it. Can you believe that? They were gonna make me pay 69 coins to fix the fix the vacuum cleaner. That's ridiculous. Dude, I am not getting so good at my power bounces. Oh, you talking about the king boo? Oh. Oh yeah, that would have worked. Instead, he brought the fart knocker cuss 42069. 69 coins. Yeah, yeah. Welcome. Also, welcome back, Spider. Welcome back. Nice. Also, thank you for the nice. Also, can I make him tiny?
Oh, it didn't work. I can't make him tiny. Oh, no. Yoshi's curse. Ve Vector's curse. Okay, don't worry. We can cure that. Don't worry. We can cure that. We can get rid of that. Now, if I was playing a Pokemon game, then I would be using full heals. I would have a full heal at the ready for confusion. Let's go. Hey, he's using a stun on you. Yeah, that's why he flinched. He made me flinch. That's why I couldn't use my attack. I flinched. There we go. Very astonishing. How astonishing indeed. Oh, oh, oh shit! <laughs> oh my god. One, two, three, four, and block. Nice. Bro. Had one thing just fell on it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Also, I really admire all the booze in the background. It's so good. Nice. But this is so cool that they actually gave Atomic Boo a new theme. I think that's awesome. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Let's go, baby. There's no escape. The only hope is the sweet relief from death. The moment he died. He's going to enjoy the sweet relief of death, even though he's already dead. <laughs> oh! Lucky start. Let's go. We got lucky start. Nice. Lucky start. We got to love it. Thank you for the GG, Spider. Thank you, thank you. Oh, wait, what the hell? Boo is dead, but he was already dead. I know. Y you know what I think happened, Rydia? I think I think he used the Monster Reborn card, and that's how he survived. Sounds pretty accurate to me. They just they just found a Monster Reborn Yu-Gi-Oh card on the floor, and that's how they came back to life. Gotta love Yu-Gi-Oh cards. <laughs> I mean, that's how everybody comes back to life. They use a Yu-Gi-Oh! Monster Reborn card. <laughs> that's how it works nowadays. Oh, they don't do the, the suck thing anymore. They don't do the suck thing. Monster Reborn, eh? Hey, Mage! Welcome in, dude. How's it going? Uh, can we get a shout-out for Mage, please? Can we, can we get a big shout-out for Mage, Sora? Guys, y'all can follow Mage. Mage also enjoys amazing variety of games like Kingdom Hearts. Really big fan of Final Fantasy. And other games. So please go get Mage a follow. How you doing, Mage? Ooh, Majora's Mask. Let's go. That's a really great game. Majora's Mask is, is so cool. What a great game. Yes, thank you, Sora, for giving Mage a shout out. Wait, huh? How did I not work? I tried. I tried on that. But we can always go for Tattle. But Mage, hope you're doing well. Hope you hope the day is treating you well. Oh, is it really? Oh, let's go. Majora's Mask is a really great game. It's actually is number. It's actually is ranked number four on my top five Zelda games. It's definitely it's definitely ne number four without a doubt. Definitely definitely my top five. 
It's just such a damn good game. I absolutely love it. I really love this Halloween battle theme. It root. It sounds really good. It sounds really, really, really good. It's really good. It kind of reminds me of Ashley's theme a, l a little bit from from the WarioWare series. That's what it kind of reminds me of. It kind of reminds me a little bit of Ashley's theme from from WarioWare. Feeling good. Let's go. But I am feeling excellent. We are playing the greatest. Mario game ever made. I am loving this remake so much. This game is so damn good. Have you played have you played this yet, Mage? Or do you plan on picking it up? Number four is a good ranking. Yeah! It's just a good game. It's just really excellent. Oh yeah! Let's go! Nice. That's perfect. Dowsing doors on my radar. Oh, dude, you're gonna love it, Mage. If you if you just love RPGs in general, you will absolutely love it. Though you don't you don't you do not even have to be a Mario fan to play this game. Like this is this is game this game is for 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 people who enjoy Mario games, people who enjoy excellent RPGs. This is this game is for everybody. Totally recommend it. Without a doubt. It's just so good. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put this on. Budding FF fan, by the way. Oh, I know you're a really big fan of Final Fantasy. I need to come back to playing more Final Fantasy, which, by the way, uh, uh, don't, don't tell anyone, but, uh, I still haven't finished Rebirth yet. But I do need to get on that. I, I, I really do have work to do. And I and by work, I mean a lot. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll have to work on, on that eventually. Oh, Final Fantasy is a great series. You can never go, you can never go wrong with Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy definitely is definitely is my in my top five of favorite franchises of all time. But I definitely want to play uh, more Final Fantasy games, like eight, nine, ten, sixteen. I want to play more F Final Fantasy games. I would like to. Oh, yeah. But that time will definitely will come eventually. Oh, good time. Have you, have you played the Rebirth yet, Mange? And have you finished it? Oh, yeah. Uh, favorite franchises are Castlevania. Final Fantasy, Elder Scrolls, Zelda, and Sonic. Nice. Yeah, I haven't played much Castlevania games. I've only played a little bit of Super Castlevania 4, and then I stopped because I, I sucked at it. But I know there are people who do like it. Also, oh my god, what the hell just happened? I've heard good things about FF9, not so many about FF8. Yeah, I've been hearing a lot of mixed things about FF8 though. I know there, I know there, I know it does have its, its fans. Some people actually do like it. Some people do like it, and some people not so much. You should try the Metroidvania. I mean, I play Metroidvania games. I mean, I do like. Obviously, I do like Metroid. I have played Metroid. I have played Shantae. That's also another Metroidvania. But yeah, I, I've played Metroidvania games before. I have. Let's go.
Oh my god, can I please? Can he not? Get out of here. Oh yeah! Need to go! I love Shantae. Shantae's so cool. Also, welcome back, Spider. I play Shantae? Yeah, I do! Yeah, Shantae's a really cool series. Yeah, I played Shantae before. I've been in a few games. But, yes, I have. I definitely have. Yeah, I, I've been in a few of them. Yeah, they're, they're pretty interesting for Metroidvanias. Oh, fudge. We're screwed. Damn it. Damn, I gotta I gotta learn to get good. I never see anyone streaming Shantae, what's the same? I used to stream Shantae way back in the day. But I'm sure there but I know there's some there's some people who do. Nice. Very nice. Let's go, baby. But Shantae's cool. I know they made a new game re I know um Way Forward actually made a new game recently. But I have I actually haven't had a chance to play yet. I think it's out already. Although at least I could be wrong. I think it is out already, not sure. Also, hello. Man, I can I am not gonna get tired of this battle fame. This battle theme is just so fucking good. Like, oh my god. See ya! Did you... The GBA version is the modern version, isn't it? I think so. By the way, Sora, if you are still here, I got a question for you. If you are here, Sora, I have a very important question I'd like to ask. It's about something that's about to happen. So, definitely let me know if you're still here, Sora. Give me the key. Because I know what we're about to do right now. Okay. Hold on a second. What? What in hell? Okay, let's go. Let's get down on it. Now we get to go see Duplins. Let's go see the boy. Let's go see our old buddy. Where are you, dupe? Hey, hang in there, slick. Oh, his theme sounds so cool! What are you doing interrupting my me time? Whoa, come on! This guy is the monster the mayor was freaking out about? Who are you calling a monster? What's your problem? Why do you need to pick a fight? I'm busy thinking of new pranks and stuff. It's not easy. It's not easy either. Now get lost! Of course you guys won't. No way you ninnies go away quietly. Am I right? Well, alright then, Slick. 
Fine. Yes. I turned the villagers into pigs. Big deal. Big deal? You stink, mister. Why'd you want to turn them to pigs anyway? Well, you know, they're also depressing and boring and dim witted all the time. So instead of wallowing in gloom, I figured they might as well wallow in mud. Ha! Now they're pigs, get it? Isn't that just so perfect? It's like irony or something. So what? You got a problem with that? I guess you do. So let's play, Slick. Speaking of Shantae, I remember playing the PS Vita. There's a Shantae on the Vita game? I didn't know that. I didn't know there was a Shantae game for the Vita. Ooh, also dude was the same. Oh my god, I love the new Dupa scene! Oh my god, it sounds so cool! Oh my god, I love it! Oh my god, it sounds so awesome! Oh, he tiny. He baby now. Oh, he baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess I'll get down and, and dirty if you're going to play like that, Slick. Oh, fudge. He's so tiny and adorable. Um, Sora, if you are here, I got a question to ask. I don't know if you're still here. Fire power, baby, let's go! Your FP is full. Oh, nice! Let's go. Tattle! Yeah, it's a t yeah, because this game is definitely a lot different. But here's the thing: in the original game, um, so in the original game, if you were to tattle him here, he goes by um, he goes by question mark, question mark, question mark, because we don't know his name yet. So if you actually want to find out his name, you gotta wait till the final chapter to get there. You find. But even though later on in this chapter, we do find out his real name. But at the start of this chapter, we don't find out who his name is. But when you actually tattle on him in the final chapter, it will tell you his name. It's just because right now, it, it won't even tell me his name. It'll just say question mark, question mark, question mark. Hmm, time to regroup here. So you think you're a couple of heavies, huh? Well then, my dear friends, if you think changing folks into pigs was impressive... Then you're gonna love this! I got something very special for you here. Oh, oh here we go. Shadow Mario! Oh my god, Shadow Mario looks so cool and he even got the Mario voice down. Oh my god! Yo, Shadow Mario! How do you like them apples? Now that's magic, people. Now you're fighting yourself. Ha! Huh? I'm a dang genius. Oh my god, Shadow Mario looks so cool! Wonder if he has a paintbrush though. Well, that, but also he's the wrong if only he was blue. He also needs to be blue. Yes, Paper Shadow Mario. Yes, that's right. That's right. That's right, Spider. Oh, we're getting. Oh, we're getting better.
Give me one second. Okay. Alright, so you know what? Okay. Alright, so you know what? You know what, Rydia? We're gonna tattle him. We might as well. I was told by Sora that we actually do need to tattle him from the start. So we're gonna go in and do that. Okay. Okay, so Sora just told me we gotta tattle him. We gotta tattle Shadow Mario. To be on the safe side? Yeah, and plus, since this is a remake, they have a lot of new stuff for tattling. Oh, yeah! Oh my god! I was about to say, was he about to die from a lamp? <laughs> Beat me? Oh, mamma mia. That's what originally brought it up. Thank you. Thank you, Rydia. Okay. Oh my god, he looks so cool! It's a new, it's a new sprite, it's a new animation, but oh my god! Thank you for the GG, Spider. Mario defeated the Scourge of Creepy Seabo and found the fourth Crystal Star. The people of Twilight Town have surely recovered from their awful curse by now. At this rate, Mario's quest to collect all seven Crystal Stars will be done in no time. With his back to Creepy Steeple, Mario sets out toward his bright future. Thank you for the GG, Rydia. Wow, are you kidding me? What a total pushover. Welcome back, Sora. Yeah, Sora, I was going to ask you. Because I know in the original... So, in the original game, I know that you can actually tattle duplins. And you will get the question mark, question mark, question mark. But when you get to chapter 8, like, sometime after you learn about his name, at the, uh, like, later on in this chapter, like, the title will actually will say his name. But, Sora, thank you for telling me that. I did not know that he had separate titles in this version. I did not know that. Thank you for filling me in on that, Sora. I actually was, I actually was curious about that. If it was going to be like the original. Well, we got the Crystal Star, so let's get out of here. Yeah, you still get the question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark, but it's a separate title even after learning his name. Gotcha. 